Now, I've been asked to focus my remarks about the broad topic of philanthropic professionals and trustees and how they can help to strengthen the black community. In thinking about this charge, it occurred to me that as African Americans working in the field of philanthropy, we are uniquely challenged to do our best work to make a difference in the African American community and to increase access to philanthropic resources. In accepting this challenge, we must not settle for average or ordinary. We must strive for greatness. Our role is to improve outcomes in the African American community and to bring others along with us. If we are to have the greatest possible impact, it is imperative that we bring our whole selves and our whole experience to philanthropy. The rich African American experience must be drawn upon if philanthropy is to be successful in supporting African American communities. These experiences will help lead the way to unique innovations and eventually to transformation. I want to provide you with a simple example of this. In the initial stages of our work in neighborhoods in Detroit, I invited a community activist in Gia Kai to talk with our trustees about our work. NGIA has a very powerful youth development program that is helping the most vulnerable youth in our city. She shared with them a story about her attendance at a youth development conference and presenting her work. At this conference, you will all resonate with this, she was asked what approach she used to serve children. What was it called? After some consideration, Ngia answered, the Big Mama strategy. <laughs> she went on to explain that she was simply doing for children what she had seen her grandmother, mother, and other women in her neighborhood do. Ngia was caring for children. She was being a big mama in her neighborhood, like so many other men and women in communities. And Gia was acting as a natural helper in her community. Now, I understood this role in the African American community immediately, just as many of you do, because it was what many unsung heroes, the big mamas and even Deacon Browns, did for me and possibly for you too. This important role uniquely reflects the African American experience. At Skillman, we have now integrated this fully into our work. It is not a traditional strategy. However, it is an extremely effective strategy in urban communities. Many foundations would not invest in this strategy because they would not understand it nor understand its roots. Throughout my remarks, I will revisit generally the unique influence that African Americans can have in philanthropy today, and more specifically, the need for more big mamas or deacon browns in both philanthropy and the African American community. <laughs> 